good, y'all. I'll be having trouble. For some reason, every time I crack a damn egg, I'm trying to see if it's the shell. It looks like it could be a piece of the baby. Yeah, yeah. You know, people made a train. Wait, we ain't putting all of them in there. Wait, what? The cups, Aiden. Oh, my homie only wanted us to put those two. Mommy, you only wanted us to put those two? No, all of them. And they supposed to go at the end down there, not with the plates and stuff. Y'all want a lot of eggs? Yeah. Y'all don't want eggs. I want a lot. 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 Ricky, you better know they do all that. They wash clothes. All that. Wash clothes. So enough do. Ricky, Ricky. Pretty Ricky. Some Taylor Ports. Your girl finna drink a little wine. Be a good day. Be a good day. Hey, hey, hey. Huh, mommy? What I was saying is y'all sorry. What I was looking for. Y'all see my black pepper? Oh, right here. How do I get rid of the boy trees? Um, I don't know. Some old people say you put an egg on it or something, I think. I got my watermelon out. They ain't the best, but I'm gonna tear them up. Y'all see my black pepper? Hey y'all, got my um Taylor Port. It was brand new one. I ain't never opened this one. It's opening now. I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator rest of them. Good afternoon to all the queens and kings. Just got to add a little water to this. You know, see, so just add water. A dream I was thinking I was dreaming about mixing up um 
pancakes and it was like I was gonna make them homemade. And I was like looking for, I was trying to figure out how you make them homemade in my dream because I didn't have the mix. So I was like, I got flour. My grandma used to use flour, eggs, and I believe milk or buttermilk, I don't know. When she used to make them when I was young and when she did it from stretch. From scratch, I meant stretch. From scratch, when she did it from scratch, she used to use um, eggs and stuff and flour. I didn't know if it was self rising or was it all purpose flour that she was using. I knew I had a win. So I was trying to figure out. I think I had a wet on the I used to use and y'all this one come out already just have to add water but what did grandma used to use like flour and eggs and something she didn't use a lot of stuff and I ain't got no vanilla flavor stuff baby I ain't got all that oh the kids the butter and the syrup gonna be just good y'all I don't wanna add all that My grandma used oh, vanilla ice cream. I don't know if you use that. But all I know is it's good as it. I don't know what you use. All I know is it's good. You like that. Kids, do not wash dishes good, baby. Every time, you're going to find something on them dishes. If I wash them, I don't play. Put my drink over there. So y'all heard about the man had the pit bulls and they say the dogs all attacked the man. My neighbor was just telling me about that story. I didn't know nothing about it. I got off the line because I didn't know if they would they want them to say what, what community we was in. <laughs> and people try to figure out, okay, now we know where she kind of stay at. So I had to get off of that because I didn't know. Oh, y'all heard about it? Somebody say so tragic. Yeah. That was scary. That's sad, man. That happened to that man. I'm telling your own animals to switch out on you. Your own damn, it be your own goddamn animals. Switching out on you. Oh, they cooking. Just making sure. Man. 
ain't gonna do the eggs until after. Rene, who you talking to? Oh, that must be Aiden Caden up there making that noise. They say I made pancake sausage eggs. Yes, honey, that's what I'm making. We thinking a lot. I ain't doing no grits. No grits. At all. They can forget about that. I'm gonna try to do them tiny. Use the olive oil. Do my pancakes. I want to do some tiny pancakes, not too big, but tiny. It's not, um, is it raining? Yeah, it's raining here. It, it's it been raining off and on. You know, some areas it don't rain and rust in some areas it do. Great minds think alike. I bit by my neighbor's pit bull. You just got bit by your neighbor's pit bull. Yeah, that syrup is my the truth. And these sausages ain't gonna take long. They, they already was cooked. I'm just basically warming them up. They already ready. Yep. I don't put oil in my oil. What is that popping? Is that the water? On this? Mm -hmm. Here's some pop. I be hate when they do that. Be scared. You don't put oil in yours. I put enough oil for that that olive oil don't play. What you use in yours? Butter or nothing? I wish I had like a better spoon. I'm going to make them tiny, y'all. Tiny little pancakes. Tiny little pancakes. I don't want them to stick together. I ain't gonna probably use all this mix. Whatever I'm gonna use, I'll be for later. Tiny little pancakes. I like them when they're so tiny. It'd be so cute to me. Tiny. Mm. Making them tiny, y'all.
Like, like what city cooking dog sells? See them on. Yeah, we have a pancakes and eggs and um, sausages for um for um for breakfast. We're gonna have some turkey sausages. Kids love pancakes, y'all. They love them some pancakes. They're so pretty. Renee. Aiden and Kaden. How many pancakes y'all want? How many? The three little tiny ones? Yeah. That's what you're getting. Three what? Pancakes. Get y'all plates ready. As soon as they're done. Where Renny at? She, what does she got there? Door shut? Oh, what? It stinks. Yeah. Tell her to get up and clean it up right now. She cleaned it up. What does it smell like, ass? Oh. Smell like ass or something? Her room? Hmm? Do her room smell like ass or something? This is, it went in at MVP. It do? It's so hard that she sprayed. I thought she cleaned the bathroom. And she cleaned the toilet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And she said, no one talk about her. Somebody say they don't use oil. Silver dollar patty cake. All that there. I like that. Look at that. Look at That's how many pancakes you want. Red! How many pancakes you want? What she said? Somebody call me? She said three. She said three. I will use butter because oil don't have a, it will just be greasy. I'm using olive oil. It's working right. just right for me, baby. It's healthier too, so it's doing all right for me, the olive oil. It ain't giving me no trouble. At all.
Get that um butter out of there for me. Well, not that bad. I was doing the country crop. The one that's in the bucket? Mm hmm. Smash them down. Get them a little flatter. I broke one of them up, but whoever my name is going to be. Yeah, the heat ain't oily like that, though. Find me a... Uh -oh. I'm over here throw these for me real quick. With the eggs? Yeah. I'm trying to make sure they don't burn these pancakes. Yeah. Be just right. Sit down and relax. Yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, baby, we getting it done. Let me cut the light on so y'all can see me. A lot better. How many agents did he want? Two. Oh, my phone cut off. It went dead on me. Ooh, they playing now, y'all. 
go ahead and flip it all over there. Put it down so that grease is getting hot and hot. Grease time. Okay, it's ready. Take the egg, move it over. You want to burn? Thank you. The wool. And this one. Oh, my damn. Hey, you two. Why is there a bee right here? Is it the inside of my one? No. It's in my neck. Trying to get that middle part done. Hey, I'm almost done. Almost.
Get it right, get it tight. Uh, get it right, get it tight. Get it right, get it tight. Where'd I put that? Okay, that's right, man. Renee and Katie. I mean, Renee and Kate, Aiden. I call everybody at the same time, y'all. Let's see. Aiden's room almost like sound. Because you could hear sound. You need to have that door open in. Open. Like, if he sounded open. Stop lying for him. He just don't, he just ignore him. I'm not. When I was in there, I heard you a little bit. Like, I heard you. Ooh. Just, ooh. Like. Tell him to come on down here right now. Y'all come on with your plates so I can get this stuff going. I can sit on down and relax. Hurry up. I want it while it's hot, hot. I like it hot. The more it's going to tell me to stop. How many sauces you want? Actually, I want two plates. You said three. Now what you getting? It's mine. You said three, too. Yes, you did. You said two. Um, Rennie want two. I did a lot of pancakes. Oh, wow. <laughs> Go on, follow. Y'all want two? Katie, Aiden, you want how many? Katie want three. You 
So you want a little bit of egg, Aiden? Me too. I want a little Wait. How many slices do you want? I want one. One little you play, get it and go on about your bed. I want one. Oh. me three, they turkey. Burnt my goddamn hand trying to. And I was like, no, baby. You want two? You want two, Aiden? Yeah. You want two, two, Katie? I want three. Oh, two softies. There you go. Burnt my damn hand. Where my butter? There you go. My fork. Only mine. Aiden, come get your plate. And do me three things. So. Thank you so much, baby. Which one are I? Kata has a big appetite, not Aiden. That's yours right there. Aiden. Thank you. Boy, boy, boy. Mm, butter. Give me another fork. I got butter all over this one. Yeah, I was outside running my mouth, you know. Mm. 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 About eight o'clock. I'm bringing it back. Mmm. Mmm, that's good with the cereal. Thank y'all. That place looks so small. I know you're. Tell him I'm moving. Come inside the tree's plate. <laughs> Thank you, baby. Thank you, Miss Wendy. So I'm a wonderful mom. You're gonna make some people mad about that comment. Here you go. The pound say send some stars on one, please. Love you. Thank you, Mark. Somebody's gonna ooh, please. I like it. Perfect size. Thank you, Mark. Thank you, Mark. Ready, we got orange juice. Thank you, Mama. You're welcome. We got orange juice. Why don't you get in the store? Thank you, Mommy. You're welcome. Yeah. 
I'm already full. He never said it. I did. He make said it. You heard him say it. You're welcome. All right, Brandon. I'm already full. I don't see y'all eat them in the pancake. Get me full. You better stop eating the sausages so I don't have enough room. Almost done. Pancakes get me full. Thank you, Miss Linda. VIP say it's weird to see Americans use plastic plates and plastic current culture. Do you reuse them or throw them away, baby? Or just save us and have to do so many dishes. <clears throat> when you're a single mom and you just don't want, you know, the kids have clean the dishes. So. Any what? It just save us from doing a lot of dishes, baby. <clears throat> I'm full. I'm trying to eat more of these pancakes, but I ain't gonna lie, I'm full. I get full quick off pancakes. You ready to bring me some more into it? Bring me that water right there, my wine. Come on. That's good. You better know I do, Miss Melissa. Can I get one? You get all the marble pancakes. Okay. Want that one? Want that one? I know where she's going to have pancakes. She just got three. Rent it. I'm so full. I, mean, I bet if we didn't have no syrup, Rennie would not want no more. Uh, she won't want, she want that serve. Oh, my lasagna, the, uh, I, I went viral with that lasagna. Breading. My, my lasagna is the truth. When I had did a video, people was like, one lady say her husband don't want no other way but my way. She say, one of my fans say her husband tasted the way, cause I, I mean, I cook ghetto. I don't cook all, you know, or, or like an artist. I cook like, I cook. And when I was cooking it, people thought, ooh, girl, what is all that you doing? But it's so good. So the video went viral. It was like 20 million and some views on that. I believe maybe less, maybe more. I know it's got a lot, it got a lot of millions of views. But one of my, a couple of people was like, honey, I did it that way. And it was so good. One lady was like, my husband said he don't want it no other way. So listen, I can cook. Oh yeah, them pancakes full, y'all. Yeah. I'm full. Well, I you full? I know I did. I'm full, but I still finished. You finished your whole plate. Ain't it? Yeah, one pancake. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I ate one. That one big. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rennie finished her food, too. And then Aiden, yeah. you drunk all your juice first. But she get less. No, I ate all the food first. Rennie gonna Oh, you drunk that orange juice. Oh. Pancakes for me out fast too, girl. I ain't seen you since paper days. Your daughter doesn't get doesn't got big, huh? Does got, does got does. Yeah, I'm the I'm the first transgender that ever had kids before. Yeah, that's me. I'm the first transgender that ever had children. They couldn't believe it. I got a coochie and a diggling. I fucked your mammy. Don't run. Oh, Lord. The baby. Her own <laughs> <laughs> she know what the word is. But I'm your daddy. And your mama. And your mammy. Me, mama. Yes, baby. Good job. Does the pancake count as a dessert? Learn her child. That the syrup count is a dessert. Pancake is just bread. You said what? Bread. Mm-hmm. 
Once you put syrup on it. Hey, y'all. Basically like fresh toast. Nisha, he said I'm a transgender somebody on with a fake page on YouTube. So I said the first transgender that ever had kids. Hallelujah. What did they just walk into? Life. The first tranny that ever had babies. I'm, I'm gonna make that my title next. I'm the first transgender that ever had kids. That's sir. Leave. You're not welcome. Hit the window. You gotta hit it. Did it leave? No. Cause oh, the wind is flexing. I mean, that's. Why would you try to open that? Now, what if that was? A, what if it was actually on a, this side? Hey, my baby, Katie, come sing a little something for me, real look quick. Like it's on this side. Oh, it's so cute. Miss Treat, you have a very respectful oh, treasure. Thank you. Thank you, Megan. Megan said, "I'm so pretty." Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Now my brain's still mm -hmm. under here. I just ain't want it in my way while I'm eating. Mm -hmm. You know. But they still here. They still hanging on. Y'all want to go to the birthday party? Who Your little cousins, you get to jump on and jump at that. Come on, Lisa, grandbabies. Damn. Is it New Town Estates? Where? The park? Yeah. I mean, if y'all want Papa to meet you up, though. Wait, how are we gonna talk? Tell him, kid. Be free. Take his mom and tell her, Brandon. He might be at Uncle Derek's house. He can walk there, mommy. That, that's the case. Look at Tyler Perry. Mommy. The mommy. prettiest person ever. Oh, thank you, baby. Mommy. Papa huh? can walk there. We did it before. Because me and Poppy, Kayla, oh, and Poppy, oh, when we got his time, we walked into that park. So y'all gotta see if we can walk. We saw our cousin, um, we saw our cousin Kylie, my grandma. And we asked her, said, hey, and she gave us some of that cake. That cake was good. Kyla who? Kyla, every time. It was like every time Who's we go Kyla? there. Sometimes Who's we Kyla? Our cousin. Me and Kayla. Our cousin. He She lived in the apartment area where Tilly. She don't. Oh, there ain't by your dad inside, huh? No, there's some kin to. She's some kin to Clyde and Stephen there. You saw her grandma, um. By they dad's side, you so we. They, the, I mean, that's why we. They say family. You saw her grandma at the. Um, her grandma is. Uh, you know, Clyde. They come over here. My cousin. I'm some kidding him by his mama. He's some kidding him by his dad. So y'all really not blood cousins, but y'all cousins by, you know, just knowing that y'all some kids to the same family. Looking at how they be eating and know you can cook. Gus Walker say, you my thug tree. Keep being you. Thank you, Gus Walker. I don't bother nobody. You know, people just feel how they feel about me. And it is Clyde, my mama, and my dad. <laughs> I love how you are very unbothered. Baby, yeah, I'm a very unbothered. Because, honey, I can't help I got my daddy jeans. <laughs> I can't help I took out to my daddy. But it is what it is. I love myself. I don't care what I know that I'm a real woman. And, you know, some men just confused. They don't know what a real woman is no more. You know, so. I mean, a real man know what a real woman is. Because a lot of, some men have a mama with deep voices and hairs and stuff on their face. You know, but I have a deep voice. And that's what make a lot of people think I'm a man. Because of my voice. Yeah. So, but other than that, it's a lot of men in this world that have a mother that have a deep voice. Some, some of y'all mamas have a mustache, a beard. You know, I mean, it is what it is. That's the part of our hormones and shit. But I damn sure got a whole real big coochie down here. It's all a real coochie, a real coochie. I love your breed. Thank you, baby. Love you, Miss Um. Your breath. Aiden and Kaden are growing up as handsome than ever. It's gonna be a handful, y'all. It's going to be a handful. I got to go take me a shower, brush my teeth, wash my tongue. <laughs> it's good. You keep a positive attitude. And some people are just ignorant. I mean, you know, I just ride. I'm from the hood. I'm from the projects. A lot of y'all, you know, ain't built for this. But I'm definitely built for it. You know what I'm saying? I don't, you know, I don't. I, I come back and hit them where it hurt. When they think they're going to hurt my feelings. You know what I'm saying? I have these bitches want to be at a concert of mine waiting and, and thinking they're going to do something. And still, still don't get to do what they want to do. 
You know what I'm saying? Because I hit them where it hurts. Some of them come on here being evil. And when you say something about somebody and then they be like, my mama dead or my daddy dead. You know, you, but you coming on here bothering me. If you know that you have ish, if you have some stuff in your life that you've gone through, I'm the type of person, I'm going to say something about your mammy. So when you come trying to hurt my feelings, if you know your mama or daddy passed away, your best bet is to don't come on my page. Your grandma, because I'm going to come hard and say some shit to hurt you too. You can look at your body and tell you're not a man. People going to talk regard. That's what they do. Tell them, eat your cat. Eat your fat cat and find out. Amen. <laughs> Amen. I like that. Look, Karina said, my voice deep. I mean, a lot of artists have deep voices. You know, Nicki Minaj's voice is deep. She's just more proper. Um, Beyonce even have a little deep, raspy voice. Um, I'm trying to think what other person I've heard out there that talk and they got a little deep voice. Um, shit, Remy Ma have like a little, you know, they just have a better accent than me. I'm more ghetto with my deep voice, so it's kind of different. It went to commercial on me. Mm-hmm. I'm on the commercial right now. That's how I make my money. They look like they dad, like the dad of Rennie Courtney and your twins. Love y'all since day one. Thank you. Definitely, man. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I'm whatever you want me to be, baby. I'm whatever you want me to be. I'm whatever you want me to be. I'm whatever you want. I like your hair. You're beautiful. Tony Braxton, you is because you say, can you say my name? Hey, Elizabeth, you want never respond back to me. I'm your true friend. Hey, Miss Francine L. Freeman, I don't be trying to ignore y'all. There you go, Teresa. If someone bring it, take it there. Yeah, they just want your cat. That's all, Floss. But other than that, yeah, I'm just, I was going to take the kids to the state fair, but they don't want to go. These boys want to stay in this house, be on the phone. Um, watch TV. Like, this is what they want to do. Like, they would pick... Now, they wanted to go to the fair because they, you know... Well, Aiden, wanted, Aiden didn't want to go because he was watching a movie. Kaden was ready. Aiden wanted to stay in the house. But I like that about them, that they don't like to run the streets and get outside. You know what I'm saying? Which is a, bit, a great thing. So, if your kids like to be in the house, thank God. Now, I do make them go outside. Keisha Cole has a deep voice, yes. I make them go outside and play or whatever and, um... They have a good time. You know what I'm saying? But um, I like to make them go outside sometimes. Rapper Gorilla has, oh yeah, she have a deep voice too. Yeah, she do. Mm -hmm, she does. Um, live on, live on YouTube. I want to go live on YouTube. I mean, you can go. Great children. Happy Saturday. Snow here in New Jersey. It's it's beautiful here, y'all. The sun is out. It's so beautiful. When I tell y'all I love Florida because of our weather, when it's sunny, I just don't like the hurricanes. I told y'all I don't like the thunder and lightning, but I love the sun here. And I love the fact that we have more summer than we have, like, winter. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of y'all have winter. We still be having the sun out. Like, we still can go to the beaches and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? That's what I love about being in Florida. Atlanta, you know what I'm saying? I like the fact that they have so much to do up there. So many different restaurants, especially a lot of black-owned businesses in Atlanta. That Star Party! Star Party! They're doing great in the new school so far. They even seen a student that they knew from that old school that go to their new school now. It's like everybody moving this way. But yeah, so yeah, they love their school. OMG, period, queen, you look so pretty. Oh my gosh, you are so god good. Gorgeous trees too. We have some new movies showing. I've been up there watching them. I'm watching a movie called um just came out in 2024. Damn what it was called. I don't, I be sometimes the movies be watching me. They gotta really be good to get me to watch them. And stay getting girl, my son stopped going with me when they were thirsty. They say going to the grocery store. I be taking to talking to people that how baby grew up being friendly. Guess what? When I get home from the grocery store. Y'all finna bring all this groceries in and put it up because y'all eat it. Thank you, Teresa. I don't eat the groceries like they do. These kids eat everything. You know what I'm saying? It's nice in North Carolina, warm and cold. Okay, that's how I be here. And Bubba Dub, boy. And yeah, that's how I be here. But yeah, I love it in Florida. But I miss Atlanta too at the same time. But yeah, I'll be back up there. My sister be having, you know, she helped me with the kids when I'm gone and stuff and my other friends and stuff. 
they home by the way you make it comfortable for them. Amen. Yes, I want to come to Florida so bad. It's Philly, Philly weather. It's crazy. It's snowing here. Trees, when I'm going to get a date, watch Rose Gold on Tubi. Already watching it. Already. Taking them out. They will not be as wild when they do go up. And, man, some kids act up for not getting out a lot. My kids don't want to go out. Some people keep their kids in the house. Like, I tell them to go outside and play. And I let them they go in the neighborhood. And, and I have them watch screen. They go through the neighborhood, play basketball. Katie and his friend, the little guy he made friends with over here. Um, he also go to the school that they go to. So, yeah, they have fun. My mom made us put everything away. I do too, Clarissa. I don't play. I don't play, honey. One time they put some stuff that was going to refrigerate in the closet. I'm like, oh, I have to go behind them. You literally remain of my mother, remind me of my mother, very blunt. Oh, thank you, girl, Miss Butler, Deja Butler. You don't look like a person who trusts people to keep your kids. I don't. I'm so only certain few can keep them, Miss Pat. Um, like, even when I let people, like, I let one of my new friends watch them, I'll be like, watch my kids. But I prefer them to watch them at my house and not take them to theirs. That's my daughter. She loves being inside. That's your daughter? Okay. Deja. She's my me. Fleming Kelly, Yolanda Fletcher. Miss Jax and family, I need your help so bad. Just scared ass. I charge, baby. I mean, just hit me up. You're doing a great job with your children. I work with people, you know, if you're struggling, you can't afford, you know, I got a little work with me program. But if you ain't struggling, don't come on, because y'all got them taxes. Them taxes on drop now. I already heard everybody been getting dates and some deposits done hit. Uh huh, y'all y'all ain't stomach right now. Drop them stars and make me say, oh my God. She said, have you ever had shingles? I don't know what that is, but I ain't had it. <laughs> I had chicken pops. I, heard, I don't know if you're talking about chicken pox, but now I had chicken pox. Have y'all seen the tree's picture that she took on Valentine's Day? She was dressed very nice. She looked. Oh, Nay Johnson. What is that? Who is Nay? That was an old picture. Been watching you a long time. You are a great mom, Trees. Thank you, boo boo. I couldn't see your name because I was reading your comment. But thank you, Steph. I'm going to go dive in this lake and see if that alligator going to play with me or he going to eat me. Which one y'all think? Where my pancakes at, trees? And baby Michelle gone. Are they gone? I ain't got these taxes. Don't want to show me no love or nothing. Y'all don't love me. Facebook, Facebook is already messing with the algorithm. Best, best is yet to come. I flew around. I love it. I. Mm. I just saw it ain't meant for my mouth. I like guess. It is, Miss Mathis. Sugar, Sharon. It was closing on your home, so that lady gave a Versace robe. Kim, I ain't wore it yet. I'm waiting for the right time to put it on. I'm waiting for the right time to put my robe on. When I give me a good look, my little, you know what I'm saying, little, little good little man, I'm putting that, I'm going to make sure I get him a robe. Like, I'm going to get my man one and me one so we both can, the kids are going to be gone. We're going to have the house to ourselves, and we're going to be walking around here with our robes on. And we just going to get freaky out everywhere. We're going to go on the porch and get freaky. We're going to go. We're going to be in the kitchen. We're going to bless this bitch all over. And then we just going to, he going to bend me over on the couch, tooted and booted. I'm talking about, I'm getting loose with that robe on. Take him in my office, eat him up on the desk. I ain't playing. I'm just waiting. For, I'm waiting for the right man. That's a real Versace. I'm going to buy him the one, the man one, and we're going to start in this bitch, baby. We're going to have a blast. I'm going to eat booty at all. Eat a new ass. Eat a new ass. <laughs> Only guy got Social Security over here. Damn, Fleming. Who claimed you? Whoever claimed you did to get your tax. Your iron is all I used to eat. I, my iron, it's, it's probably it's, it's whatever it is. I spelled my son A I D E M. A-I-D-E-M. What the hell you know them kids on this album? Fuck them kids. 
The kid no more than us. The kid know about sucking and fucking. What you talking about? Man, get off my page. I knew about it when I was 12, 10, 13, 11. 10, 9, 8, bitch, you up here talking about what kids, kids on this album. Get your kids off the motherfucker. Well, my damn show no stuff. And you'll come around, bitch, they go no fuck with me. I'm going to teach them shit. Don't be doing this. Don't do that. You do your teach your kids. Y'all so busy hiding from them. That's why they ass sucking and fucking die. Because y'all ain't letting them see the diseases on these diggerlings. You got to pull a dick out and let them see them little herpes soles on it. And them little coochies and let them see. So they won't want no shit. Y'all want to keep don't talk like that around my children. You better start talking. You better start talking. You little motherfucker sucking more did than other. They started it. Kids. Hmm. Shit. They be like, where dick sucking come from? Kids. <laughs> you little hoes around here eating dick and so good. I, I mean, I, I heard a nigga tell me, he said, man, that whole 12, 10, 11, 12, 13 sucking dick a little. Nigga say, man, she sucked my thing so good. Say, man, I had to leave that girl alone if I won't go to jail. I said, oh, and her mama had her doing it. She was 12. The mama used to sell her. Let her go out there for the money. And she, they say her head so good. I said, baby, I'm a bite them. I'm just, just getting good with sucking dick and lean. Baby, I would have, baby, at 12, 13, I would have been chewing it. Your thing would have been gone. It would have went in my little mouth at 12 years old. Mm-mm. They say that little bit head so good. Say she was eating up all the diggling. Her mama was selling her to baby, please. Mine ain't finna be spraying her sucking no thing. I'm gonna beat that bitch in her mouth. But when you grown, ho, get out my goddamn house before you go to suck it on something. I better not catch her with it in her mouth, bitch. I'm going to jail. They're gonna be like, what happened? She beat her teeth out. I'm be on my mugshot smiling. Don't give a damn what y'all say. Baby, they gonna be. Oh, she shouldn't. She must be seeing it somewhere. I don't give a damn. Then you're going to have some people say, oh, no, I probably would have snapped too. Then you're going to have some people say, honey, that ain't my business, honey. Can you be cussing my dear? Be outside with them. Baby, when they outside, they cussing like a dog. Cussing like a dog. Oh, they going bitching. I can't wait to talk to my daughter about it. I got a little time. She five, baby. Now's the time, Clarissa. You wait till what the fuck you talk about. You need to be talking to her now. Oh, no, I was five, six years old. My friend had me watching their ass hunting this shit. Yo, uh, baby, this is the time. You just gotta, you know, know how to talk to her. But talk to her, let her know. If anybody try to touch your stuff or try to encourage you to do something, you let me know and you show her those digglings and coochies with them diseases. This is the best time. I should have showed Rennie when she was four or five. Maybe two. Yeah. And wait, that you and then it ain't. It's all the, the the time is right soon. They when they under when they understand some shit. They know what titties and all that is. Goddamn it, coochie. This is the time. Soon she got a little common sense where she can understand and li listen. Talk to her now, baby. By the time she ten, she'll be so scared of a diggling. She'll be but I ain't put. I don't know. I'm gonna tell my mommy. Mm -mm. My mama taught me at five years old about that stuff. No, that this is the best time. A lot of people hide stuff from their kids and trying to keep them away. And that's why shit happen. My kids know everything. They know about guns. They know about, I tell them about diseases and all that. They're trying to scare their ass. I don't know them. But then it's always about it. That can encourage them so they can get around the wrong children. And your mama, your class a lie. Your mama just trying to scare you. Your mama just trying to scare you. That ain't real. Every, that don't happen to everybody. So sometimes people can encourage your kids. And you got to let them know that too. Some kids will try to encourage you and they tell you I'm wrong. But you better listen to me. Because I'm telling you not. Them the ones you got to watch. The ones that's telling you that your mama lying. Them the motherfuckers want you to do something. Because, you know, you're going to be like, damn, my mama was telling the truth. You got to tell them that too. Because it's other kids that encourage them to do them wrong and make them feel like, oh, your mama just trying to scare you. My little ass will cuss you the fuck out at many six. Ooh, honey, my guts. My little niece, my little god sister. Three, telling people to eat her coochie. Suck my, and her mama used to be right there with her to my tell her. When niggas used to say stuff, she'd be like, suck my pussy. Three years old, telling people that her mama thought that was cute. Like, I'm just not that mother. You're not gonna tell no man to suck your, or uh, kiss your, at three years old, baby. Not even at, you better not even be saying that 13, 14 round. I'm going to hit you your shit. And 
at three years old, babe, I used to want to pop up myself, but you know, that was my godmama's job. And she used to be a mess, honey, something I could kiss my ass. She didn't give a damn when she was a little older. She probably still a cousin, bitch, I died telling her the same thing. She 20 something now, but honey, she was three years old telling her to kiss her ass and all that down. And F U B, yes, man, as you get it down when they curiously wants to know, yeah. My cousin tried to get me to hunt up when we was little kids. To my son, let's do it. No, you're gonna tell grandma I was six. She was seven. To my, ooh, let's do it. I said, I'm gonna tell grandma. I said, I'm just playing, you weren't playing. Yeah, you weren't playing. You was not playing. You were dead serious. You thought I was gonna be down with it. What would it was? You gotta talk to the kid. And she was praying. I heard a little girl tell her to kiss her. I was heated. Uh-uh, let me get you from around her. Let me get you from around her, baby. Uh, you can't never hang with her no more. You got to watch your sister kids, your homegirl kids, everybody. You got to be a type of mother that sit there with them and observe and watch and secure. Bitch, you got to be security with these kids. You knew that shit wasn't right, huh? Yeah, I knew that shit was retarded. Bitch, we cousin. We ain't got no bit of hunching each other. See, I just knew it wasn't right. Some kids don't give a damn. I mean, some kids do it, but not me. Yeah, I'm not brothers and sisters be doing it, but... I just was never that type of child. I ain't like, I just knew. I used to hunt kids outside, you know, that wasn't no kin to me. Probably hunt some that was some kin to me, but I didn't know. But the ones that I knew, man, ain't no motherfucker about it. We is not hunting. I done took baths with my cousin, me and my cousin, a girl and a boy, and I wouldn't even look at them. I used to, we used to write on each other back. Like, we was, I was about four, they five and six. We all in the tub together. We put soaps on each other back and write on that. You know what I'm saying? I used to write little stuff and say, you know, and then guess what I'm writing? And I write my name, T-R-E-S-E, Trees. -E, and we used to know what we was writing. Like, we used to do stuff like that. We, I never in my life touched my cousins or had did anything with my brothers or sisters. I just didn't do it. And there was a lot of kids I do did it. It was people I grew up with did it. People in my family did it, you know? I just didn't do it. Mm -mm. My grandma never told me not to. It's just I always knew in my mind that wasn't right because we're family. And I knew we, so you shouldn't do that. Like, you know, it's, you know, when I live in the project, there were so many other little kids I can go hunch on and do little shit with. What I look like doing with my brothers and sisters and my cousin? Mm -mm. I love you, trees. Everybody need them a trees. I'm right here, Miss Jones. You just keep it real. Hell yeah. But you can't judge, you know, I don't judge no children that did it because as long as they stop doing it at a certain age, you're all right. You, you're just doing some shit that's, you know, looking up psychology, saying that it's normal, too, because they're, they're, they're basically curious. And they want to, they, they, you know, that's what kids do. But I wasn't curious enough to, to worry about nobody else. I was looking at my grandma coochie and seeing her ass shitting and pissing in front of me all my life. And her shit was big and huge and stuff. And Harry and stuff, and I used to ask her questions about it. I'd be like, why don't, why I don't got that down here? Why I don't have hair? And she'll say, when you get older, you're going to get it, baby. And why I don't have them things right here? And she'll tell me, well, you, because you're too little. You know, and she's, I sit right there in her ass while she pissing, duking, looking at all her stuff, and she, and, and, and asking her questions about it. And shit, and hers was big, and mine was cute and little. And I was looking at it, and I was wondering why the hell I had, I know how. <laughs> on my stuff, and she had how why well, I ain't got no titties, and she got titties. My grandma used to tell me everything, and I used to be curious. I was a curious little girl. Well, how we got here, grandma? And she'll say, "Well, your mom and daddy, you know, made you, but God gave gave you to them, and God made you, and all that type of stuff." Had trying to, you know, I used to want to know some shit. I ain't gonna lie, but like, how we got here? You're like, what? How do we get here? My grandma be telling me my little the little stories. She'll try to get me right, but I just knew something else was going on. Like, so he just, God made us, and when he put me in my mama's stomach, well, your daddy and your mama got together, and they, they um came together, and they made you. She don't tell me they had sex and that, y'all. She'll just say, they came together, and God gave, you know, they created you. <laughs> she was trying everything up out not to tell me they, he put his dick in her, or nothing like that. So she had to say they got together. And stuff like that, trying to describe to me, baby. I, these days, honey, look, your mama and your daddy, that thing down there that you got between your legs, you went down. Don't come thinking up for the tell you. I'm going to tell you, tell you how you, to tell you the truth. 
and you don't want to have no kids. You don't want them doing that young because they'll tell your guy to pooch you up. That's why you don't have sex. Baby, my grandbabies better not come asking me about no goddamn how you got here. I'm going to give it to them blood raw. Keep your little stuff in your panties because you get pregnant. And it, I'm going to show them a video of a woman having a baby. And it'll split your old, old baby. I'm going to have so scared, baby. They're going to be like, I don't want to ever do that. You got to wait till you grow and marry because your little stuff ain't done growing yet. You ain't got no business getting pregnant. Right now at 13, 14, because your shit's still developing, and that baby gonna tear your ass up. Yeah, I tell them just like that. I don't give a damn who say I'm wrong. I'm gonna be a cool ass grandma. I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna, it's gonna be explicit. I'm gonna give it to your blood raw. I ain't got time to play. Uh uh uh. They gonna say my grandma keep it, give it to me real. I don't wanna be, I don't wanna sugarcoat shit. I don't want you. I don't want to give it to y'all cute. I want to give it to you so goddamn nasty, make you scared to want to do something. I would, you know what I'm saying? My grandma never gave. My grandma, oh, you, your mom and dad got together. Man, tell me how it went. I used to sniff people's seeds. I did that too, sniff people's seeds. They got my ass tore up and they sniffed me another seed after that. I sniffed seeds for years. My auntie finally caught me. My ass would be stank all the time. I said, ooh. I wonder what a booty smell like. I used to just smell it. Every time I say, mm, I look at my grandma, my grandma go to laugh. I say, ooh. My grandma say, why are you smelling behind that? You lay behind, babe. I said, because the booty bay it was big and wild. I used to be wondering what her booty smell like. And one day my grandma said, they set my ass up, huh, babe? My grandma told babe, yeah, when you leave, she be smelling behind your behind. I had been doing it for a long time. And the last my daddy, my grandma seen me doing it. She told Babe, so Babe played it out. They got my ass. So I used to sit there and just wait for Babe to leave. It was just a habit. And so Babe said, all right, Mama. I'll see you. I'll probably come back by tomorrow. They going to find one out one day. And it best to come from you. Then someone else, hell yeah. Babe, Babe got up, walked to that door, did what she said to my grandma. Soon as babe went out that door, my grandma, my grandma so slick, she don't went in the kitchen. She they plied on me now. I ain't know they plied on me. Babe act like she shut the door. I'm over here on the couch, tune up, smelling that bitch. I got my head like them. Babe walk back in that goddamn door real quick on my ass. She said, Oh, I caught your little stack of ass. I'm finna tell you. I look down, I said, damn, she caught she beat my ass out. Stop smelling behind my ass. <laughs> I looked at my grandma like, you a best, you fucked up. Grandma laughing, and come out laughing. <laughs> I told you, I told you. Mm -hmm. I ain't smell her ass no more after that. I ain't smell her ass no more. I ain't smell it no more, honey. You ain't got to worry about me sniffing them. But when she came over, I got the hell out of the way. And then my auntie back, my auntie to bring her baby over there. I used to pinch the shit out of him. I took his ass behind the couch. My grandma had the couch where it was out where you could climb behind this kid. And I took him and turned the skin, pinching his ass every time I could stand him. Why you bring him over here? Because grand time, grandbaby. This ain't your grandbaby, baby. I'm the baby. I used to be so jealous. If, uh, when they come over, she's showing them all that love and shit. I ain't like it. Took his ass behind the couch and turned the skin. My auntie say, my auntie kept wondering, what is going on with my baby? So... One day she came over there again. He come out screaming and hollering. He didn't know how to talk and tell her I pinched him. He'll come out doing, grabbing his arm. My auntie be like, well, what's wrong? I be like, he hit his arm on that chair. Lied my ass off. Baby, one day he had that. They came back. Huh? What's up? What? Talk to me. What's up? Clean that room up. Clean your room up. I want your room clean real good. Clean your room. Get that shit from under the bed and all that. But not be none on that bed. Not a shoe. Not a nothing. Not a piece of paper. Nothing. Clean the rooms up first. And honey, my auntie was my, Everybody always set my ass up. So my auntie looking over the couch the whole time. Plotting on me, right? And we sitting down. And I take his arm and I twist that bitch. And she say, oh, huh, little bitch, I caught you. <laughs> I remember that mother word. She say, oh, huh, little bitch, I caught you. 
She brought my ass behind the couch, told my ass up, I ain't pinch him no more. I was evil. I ain't like people coming over there. I was the only grandchild staying there. I ain't want nobody else there. Why is they here? They need to go home. They got a mama. I ain't had a mama. Big Monty beat my ass. She said, uh-huh, little bitch, I caught you. Beat my ass. Oh, dirty ass. Told my ass up. And my cousin, he was sitting there happy to the bit. Like, yeah, she finally caught your Eve ass. We used to push everything out to him. I hate that how that person leave behind after they walk past you. Ooh, Lord. Something wrong with you and your baby. You need a bathe. If a bitch can smell you when you walk by. Now, you might smell me when I fart. But you ain't smelling my coochie. Ain't now bitch for the smell of my coochie. Only way a bitch gon' a big on lie say my coochie probably funky out of anger. You know, I got a nigga or two probably said it because they mad at me. But they can't stand me. They want to make me look bad because they know that's my biggest pet peeve is having a stain coochie. I don't want to stain coochie. I bathe my coochie. So it's a it's a couple niggas that, that's really like mentally challenging that hate me. Cause uh, cause I dogs them out when I go at it. They probably lie and say my coochie stain. Y'all got a mama. Shit, I ain't had none. Mine wasn't there for me. My grandma was. Why well, I find placement for them? Yolanda, uh-uh, he don't need to be eating it now. Can I come out of the basement? Your mammy must be put you in there, baby. You need to ask her. I ain't saying that. You, you can't, you say it. Why well, I find place? Hey, how you been? I've been good, baby. God bless you. God bless you, Nate. Dave. Nate, Davis, you 13. Why y'all got these people kids? And why, one of my friends said he a life fun. He like funky. Anyone that got chicken box can get chicken there. No, ain't it, but it's more likely to occur when you're older. Yeah, I heard. I heard you get shingles when you're old, not not while you're old. Young. Yeah, but I got to get off of here. Look at Marcus Birch to my man, please. I got to get off of y'all so I can go brush my teeth, get my stuff together. I don't like to brush my teeth after I eat. I don't, some people brush their teeth before they eat, but I just, mm, I have to brush them after I eat. Cause all that food be in my teeth, so you might well brush them twice. But, um, you nine, yeah, right, with all the, you nine, yeah. Kids, sneak, you definitely gotta watch behind them, tell their sneaker, and the thing, I I keep my wrinkles, they ain't fresh, and my man is crazy about it, love it. Hey, you're up in the bed. Wake up and pass by that room, and I see plates and forks when they were young. A nasty asses. Mm-hmm. Child, y'all just be trying. Y'all, y'all are born. May you have a one. I will, Mac, my door. I love y'all. God bless y'all. Let me get my set together so I can go support my little cousin for his birthday and, uh, and all that though. You like funky women? Oh, James Brown, let me toot it in your face. All right, y'all be